A look at what we expect over the next couple of days now through Thanksgiving Day at 7 o'clock in the evening. Now, overnight, well, we've had some cloud cover show up late in the day on Tuesday. It's likely to continue through the overnight hours, and it'll moderate how low we go for during the overnight hours, so it won't cool off all that much. We'll see a light southerly wind to start the day. I think we'll see the wind pick up during the day, though. Rain? Well, it's pretty questionable whether we're going to see much of anything around 11 o'clock, 12 o'clock tomorrow, because it'll all tend to fall apart. And the forecast models have really been kind of consistent on this, uh, just having it fall apart as it, <clears throat> pardon me, as it enters the region. It sprinkles. If it does enter the region, it would likely fall apart. So carry an umbrella if you want to. Chances are you're not going to need it. Big story is uh, we'll see the temperatures pop up to around 70 during the afternoon coming up on um, Wednesday. 17 mile an hour winds likely gusting to around 20, 25. Overnight, the cool air hits though because by f Thursday morning, uh, Thanksgiving morning, temperatures drop back on down. More of a northwest to westerly wind flow into the area. There's where we are 1 o'clock in the afternoon around 56. And by late in the day into the nighttime hours, the wind will really pick up and that will really drop our temperatures on down. Kind of a secondary kick of cooler air uh, that will really hit for Thursday night and into the day on Friday. Uh, anyway, uh, 70 degrees coming up uh, for Wednesday. Outside chance of rain. 56 on Thursday. Definitely cooler for Thanksgiving Day. Definitely cooler than that Friday and Saturday with the chance of rain Saturday night continuing into the day Sunday.